And then before this thing topples, because knowing me, I'm such a clumsy- OH MY- so we just got back from dinner, we as in me, my mom, my sister, my cousin, and my aunt. The first thing we saw when we entered the car porch was this centipede. Yes, I saw a centipede and my mom was like, kill it, it's gonna kill you. <laughs> it's kill <laughs> Yeah, I'm over exaggerating, but my mom just told me to kill it. And I was like, no, you watch the centipede while I go get a container. So I went to get a container and then I realized that container was too big. Yeah, but then I moved the container around to see if the centipede was alive or dead because it didn't really move. And then I just started moving, but it only move a little bit it wasn't like what a centipede is supposed to do centipedes as soon as something touches it it bolts it bolts away quickly if you've not seen dark dance video the feeding my devil video it's one of his viral videos go check it out do not mess with that <laughs> well yeah anyways i cut the centipede in this huge container and then i realized it was too big so i went and take a smaller container cup that one i mean not cup i mean i just put it like at the side and then i pushed it in and it crawled straight in and usually centipedes they don't do that because I saw the centipede was already moving pretty slow so I just tried my luck and it just cooperated and went in. So I took it upstairs looking at how lethargic this thing is I offered it some water some fresh water in hopes that it'll regain its strength after drinking because today has been a pretty darn hot day here so I'm guessing that this guy is dehydrated and just needs a drink to regain its strength because tarantulas that's what happens if you see a tarantula in death curl but it's still moving offer it some water and it should regain its strength so yeah hopefully this guy regains its strength and yeah i'll leave him here overnight and we'll come back tomorrow it is the next day what's going on guys and unfortunately things just didn't go as we planned just take a look at this so this was the little guy that we found yesterday and it's motionless it's it's pretty much dead so unfortunate but i kind of expected it to happen but actually i was hoping that after giving it some water it will sort of regain its strength but unfortunately i guess it was just already on its deathbed because when i caught this guy he didn't really move fast at all he was just twitching around like that they move pretty fast generally. The moment you cup them, they will start running around the enclosure, I mean the container, but unfortunately this guy, as you guys saw, he was just walking around like, yeah. Even when I provided him some water, he didn't really like rush to the water to drink, he just, just sat there. I don't even know if he was drinking or not, he was just sitting there on the water because I pushed him there. But yeah, that is pretty much the end. This is the cherry red centipede, and oh, check out those fangs, those mandibles right there. Man, if those dig into your skin, yeah, that's not fun. But this guy, come on, man. Why did you just die on me? I had so much of hope, although I kind of expected that you were gonna be dead, but I had some hope, okay? I had some hope that you might survive and you just bailed on me. Hmm. Okay, but anyways, I've got this container over here where I'm going to be preserving him. You can see it's about the perfect size, right? But the thing is, I'm going to be putting him in here and it's going to be curled at this section over here. He's not going to be at the top here, so I'm not sure how this is going to be. But this container was actually a container of eucalyptus oil. Yep, eucalyptus oil. I just never used it. I have no idea why I bought it, but yeah, I found the container with the eucalyptus oil inside. But then I decided to pour it away because... I want to preserve this guy and I mean I'm not even using the oil so what's the point right so I just decided to pour it away clean the bottle and yes since it was oil I had to use soap so yeah I had to use soap and I shaked it around and then I kind of clean that's how I cleaned the bottle okay and then I had to take out the tag the um, label because you know when you buy these things they always put those wordings on top and then you have to like scrape it off it's so annoying it took me literally about 15 minutes to just get that off and when I was done like half I was like oh my god it's only been halfway <laughs> but then I just continued and eventually I was done and then I had to get some cologne to get rid of the glue which surprisingly I was so surprised that it was super easy to take off I just sprayed some on and I used a paper towel to just wipe it off and the glue just came off just wow okay so yeah, if you guys want to get rid of those stubborn glue go steal your dad's cologne don't tell him I told you this but just go steal some of his cologne and just yeah <laughs> but yeah anyways let's rehab this oh no not rehouse let's preserve this guy into this enclosure no and not enclosure you see i'm so used to housing tarantulas from enclosure to enclosure that i think that this is rehousing yeah oh my gosh but yeah as i said this is not scripted again i did not say that but usually all of my videos are not scripted i just say i just talk to my phone as i'm doing things and then after that i edit and just cut stuff but yeah let's get this i, I, I almost say rehouse again 
it. Let's get this preserved into this container. And I've got my alcohol over here. It's just methylated spirit because I don't have like isopropyl or formaldehyde. We don't get those here. But I mean, I have my other wet specimens and they have been going years and years and years with this. I know it's not as good as isopropyl or formaldehyde, but if it works, it freaking works. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, anyways, without any further ado, oh, I almost stabbed myself, but but anyways, this is a focus, dang it, focus phone, this is an injection needle, fine phone, don't focus, there we go, that's an injection needle right there, what I'm going to be doing is getting some of this alcohol and injecting it into the body of the centipede so the inside can be preserved, whoa my gosh, I thought it moved right there, whoo, but yeah, it's dead. It's it's 100% dead. Don't worry. So what I'm going to be doing, which I've already mentioned, first I'm going to have to open this. I'm going to have to inject this alcohol into that because if I just toss it into alcohol, the outsides will preserve, but the insides will stay raw. So basically, I'm going to use this needle, put it in, and just suck up some alcohol. There we go. Go. See? Beautiful alcohol. Single use only, okay? Do not use syringes more than one time. But anyways, let's let's just do this as quick as possible. I feel like a doctor. But the thing is, I'm better doctor because one hand, guys. One hand. Oof. Come on, let's go, bro. Okay. You know what? I'll do it on the carpet because the needle can go through much easier. Watch this. It's not rocket science. Just poke it in. Just like. Oof. Just like that. And then we just squirt in some juice. Whoop. All right. Juice in there. Come on, needle, get out. And then I guess I will put some at the head over here. Stab. Whoop. Sorry, dude. Although you already did. Now, this guy he gave me so much of hope, but he bailed on me. He came to me alive saying, Hey, you may catch me and make me your new pet. But then the next day, he just changed his mind and just decided, I want to die on this guy. So, yeah, unfortunate. One last stab. Let's go. There we go. All right. So insides should preserve nicely. And what I'm going to be doing now is getting this and putting the little guy in. I think this container is a little bit too big. But I mean, let's just have a quick look of him before we put him in. Oh my goodness. <laughs> All right. So here is his head. I mean, if this guy just comes alive right now and starts chewing on me, that will not be fun. Because these guys, I heard they can give you fevers. Yep. The venom in this thing can give you fever. Don't even know, man. It's crazy stuff stuff right there. And the thing is, when I came into the house and I saw this over here, I mean, not over here, I mean, at the corner of my house over there, like at my entrance, I thought that someone was playing a prank on me because I actually do have this toy centipede, which is around the same size as this. So I thought someone just put it there and wanted to play a prank on me. But unfortunately, no, it was not a prank. It was this and it just decided to die on me. All right. Anyways, without any further ado, let's I'll elevate it. There we go. So we can see. Beautiful creature. A lot of people are scared of these. I mean, I'm scared of them as well. I'm gonna have to, like, stuff him in. Dude, cooperate. Although you're dead. Oh my gosh. That, 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 that's just weird. <laughs> okay, come on. Let's go. Let's go. Just, just squish yourself in, man. Squish yourself. Oh my. Okay, that was easy. Just make him into shape. I don't want him to be droopy like this. Anyways, I guess we can reposition him later. Get the alcohol out. And I'm gonna have to put this thing. Whoa, my. Okay, put this thing in here, so if any alcohol leaks out, I will not be wasting, right? See? Not rocket science right there, it's just common sense. So now, let's... I don't even know if this is enough alcohol. I'm just gonna pour the whole bottle in. Yep, this bottle is definitely too big, but it works. It freaking works. And then we have some leftover alcohol. Just plop it in like that. And then before this thing topples, because knowing me, I'm such a clumsy- Oh my- Wow. 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 As I was saying. As I was saying! Well, there goes like a third of alcohol. Wow. I'm a genius. Now my carpet's wet. Perfect. I'm a genius, man. I'm a genius. You guys gotta like worship me. You know, just kidding. Do not. I'm, I'm such a weird guy. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, that will be it, I guess. Uh, why am I so dumb? I should have just covered it as soon as I said it. Anyways, that is pretty much it. Not sure what I'm gonna do now. Gonna have to go buy more alcohol because I was such a fool. I said it will drop because I'm clumsy, but then I didn't cover it. Yeah, okay. Uh, my Gosh, I'm such a such a loser, man. But yeah, anyways, that'll be it for this video. Unfortunate video, but I mean, you guys wanted the update, so I gave you the update.
not a very nice update, but an update is still an update. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. If you liked it, thumbs it up. If you didn't, thumbs it down. I did not kill this guy. I literally gave it water and hoped for the best that he will survive. But unfortunately, things just didn't go as we planned. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care and peace.